Yo, 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 family. Shalom. Hope y'all are doing well. We've made it to Wednesday, man. Where is the promise of his coming? Enoch, the seventh from Adam, prophesies of these sayings. Behold, the Lord cometh with ten thousand of his saints to execute judgment upon all. Behold, he cometh with the clouds, and every eye shall see him, and they also which pierce him. And all the kindreds of the earth shall wail because of him. The Lord himself shall descend from the heaven with a shout, with the voice of the archangel, and with the trump of God. And the dead in Christ shall rise first, and then which we which are alive and remain shall be caught up together with them in the clouds to meet the Lord in the air. And so shall we ever be with the Lord. The grace of God that bringeth salvation hath appeared to all men, teaching us that, denying ungodliness and worldly lust, we shall live soberly, righteously, and godly in the present world, looking for that blessed hope and the glorious appearing of the great God and our Savior, Jesus Christ. Exactly. I hope you guys have a good one, okay? And keep smiling, man. I mean, you know, things might get crazy. Things are going to get crazy. And the ones that doubt the promise of his coming, you know, let them remain doubtful. It's like the Lord says, you know, there's going to be the ones that remain just, the ones that remain unjust, the ones that remain unrighteous and righteous. Just at some point... Either people are going to realize what you're speaking to them is the truth, or they're not. But what you can do is pray. Is pray for people. Pray for your family and friends to wake up. And stand bold, guys. Don't be, don't be afraid to, to be a warrior for Christ. Don't be afraid to spread the gospel to, you know, if you're having dreams or visions or Anything that the Lord tells you to tell, tell it. Don't be afraid. If he commands you to tell it, then do it. I love you guys. Y'all take care. And like I said, just, you know, trust and trust in it. Trust in his coming. And trust that it's going to happen in our generation. If you're paying attention, you're going to see it. And if you're not seeing it, ask him to reveal it to you. Later.